What's good guys, welcome back to Ron's Rise, welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to another video, and hear me out here. An Alfa Romeo Giulia Quadrifoglio station wagon. Just, just listen, listen real quick. Now presented in 2015, the Tipo 952, the first Alfa Romeo to be built using the rear and all wheel drive Giorgio platform. Now, subsequently, the vehicle was launched on the market in various versions, including the Alfa Romeo Giulia Quadrifoglio. Now, for those who are wanting a station wagon version aimed at families, Alfa may never offer a similar model or an all-road variant, but it's nice to dream, right? Now, having said that, the digital artist Sugar Chow imagined and rendering what the Alfa Romeo Giulia Quadrifoglio wagon could look like and the front and rear overhangs shorter than we can see on the other station wagons on the market. Now Sugar has decided to implement some features of the Quadrifoglio such as the four sport tailpipes in the rear and the engine hood with air intakes. I mean this special Julia Quadrifoglio wagon also boasts the panoramic roof with fixed glass and two aluminum bars that make it perfect for families. Now, if you guys don't know or don't remember, the Alfa Romeo Giulia Quadrifoglio does not come with a panoramic roof or sunroof at all because of the carbon fiber fixture for the roof. Only in the Stelvio Quadrifoglio that does not have a carbon roof can you get the panoramic roof. So this would be a nice change to have the panoramic roof in the station wagon. Now, according to the future product plan for Alfa Romeo, the mid-cycle renewal of the Alfa Romeo Giulia and Stelvio is scheduled for 2021 of next year. And also at the end of 2021, well, the Tonali concept should be arriving at dealerships and will also debut in the same year. Now, while in 2022, we're getting a B SUV from Alfa Romeo, they might be nice to see something like an Alfa Romeo station wagon in the future because this looks awesome. I really like the design here. It kept the real Alfa DNA, but really just making it a little bit more practical. I mean, just really, it reminds me of the German rivals like Mercedes and BMW. Actually, more of a Mercedes Audi rival, uh, more of a BMW station wagon kind of look. I really like the round edges. I really like the aggressiveness that it keeps. It looks like it goes fast, which we all know, 505 horsepower from this twin turbo V6. And you know that beautiful exhaust note that comes out of that once you get up to dynamic 3000 RPMs or race mode, it's really gonna take a station wagon to the next level. But let me know what you guys think about this design that has been imagined by the artist Sugar Chow of an Alfa Romeo Giulia Quadrifoglio wagon. Now with that said, if you guys enjoyed the video today, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Giving it a thumbs up helps get the video up in the rankings, more people can see it, and we have a bigger discussion about the Alfa Romeo Giulia Quadrifoglio wagon. Now with that said, if you guys wanna help support the channel, Always check the links down below. I have a one-time link donation for my PayPal. You guys can just check that out. You can donate a dollar or two to the channel. And you can also be a Patreon member as well. If you guys want to support further, you can always check out the Ron's Rise merch where you can get a Ron's Rise t-shirt, stickers, hoodies, everything like that. You guys can also post it on your social media for our Instagram and tag me in it and I will repost it for you guys so everybody can see that you guys are supporting the brand. You can also check out the Facebook, Snapchat, Instagram, all my good social where I'm posting Maserati, Alfa Romeo, car memes, everything like that. It doesn't always make it here to the channel. And subscribe and click that notification bell so you can get these videos straight to your inbox. And guys, be safe, be blessed, stay healthy. We will talk to you guys in the next Ron's Rise video. Peace.